was good. What's popping? Keandre's in the building. Let's talk about the concept of money. Let's talk about the concept of money because I have been living here in Louisville, Kentucky for 17 years. So from 13 years old till I was about 22, I lived in Jefferson County. I had never lived outside of Jefferson County from 13 years old to 22 years old. I've always stayed where the grass was greener. And so the same people who were stressed about paying $1,500 a month and then they look at me, and I'd be like, that's easy. And then they ask me where I used to live at, and then I tell them verbatim the addresses. Because I can tell you both apartments that I've been at in Park Lafayette and the apartment I lived in, Fenwick Park Place. These are both in Jefferson County. In Jefferson County. Um, so how I grew up was all easy to me. That's the type of lifestyle I was used to having. And if you think I wasn't a dependable a, de a dependable person, I worked three jobs when I was living in Jefferson County. I worked at UPS, Amazon, and Papa John's while going to Southern University. Meaning, I did four hours at night at UPS. After I left there, the morning is coming up. I go to Amazon for 10 hours. Then I'll swoop around and go to Papa John's. Then in the mix of all that, I'm going to school. Because I got three degrees. I worked my butt off. So basically I'm saying everything that I have is paid off. So all the money that I'm working on now goes to what is needed to be taken care of, which is necessities, which is rent, bills. I'm in a happy marriage. I've been with the same woman. We about to go on nine years in February. Nine years in February. Five years of marriage in September. Um, and then when people be trying to tell me that this costs this, I'm like, okay. Like, I can't take care of it or something? Like, if someone asks me, and I have the money to give it to you. And everything else is taken care of at home. And you are in need of it. I'm going to help you. I'm going to help you. And if you do not take my hand in the help, I'm not going to give, I'm not going to like try to help you again. Because if I try to help you the first time, you say no. Hey, that's up to you. That's up to you if you want to be stressing about your vehicle, about whatever is going on in, in people's lives. That's all I'm saying. These ain't no subliminals. These ain't attacking nobody. I'm just speaking off the examples I'm hearing each and every day. 
each and every day. And and my goal for next year in 2025, I already got it down. I already got it wrote down. I'm going to be deleting things off my credit to get my credit back to what it used to be. I'm not, see, like, I try to help people, but I've learned that you can try to help people, but then they'll feel like they owe you. Look, if I help you, you don't owe me for nothing. I'm doing this for GP. I'm doing this because I want to help. Like, if I had the money, and like, if I was a, a millionaire, and somebody's in need of something, if you ain't got a place to stay, I'm going to make sure you get in a place. I would buy land and build up something for the homeless. Everything I say, I stand on business. I stand on business. Like, this ain't a game to me. This is not a game. Like, whatever I say, if I say I'm going to do something for someone, I'm going to do it. But before I do it, I speak with my wife before I act on it. I let her know the situation on who I'm helping, on why I'm helping. And if my wife says that we need stuff at the house, then I'm helping at the house until everything is taken care of at the house, then I will navigate to helping people who are in need of it. So, my concept of money is different. My concept of money is different. A thousand is a lot for people. Over Mm. Let me see. Uh, over 4,000 is a lot to me. Over 4,000 for something is a lot to me. Because because I have things that cost over 4,000. I have things that cost over 2,000. With these iPhones, case in point, I've had numerous iPhones. Each each iPhone I've had paid it off. Paid it off. Um, but yeah, my concept of money is different. My concept of money is different. Everything I work for, I earned it. You know what I'm saying? I earned it. Everything I've had in this lifetime, I've earned it. I worked for it. Everything in this house, I've worked for. My wife and I worked for this. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't have to look over my shoulder to see if somebody's going to take some from the house because it's paid off. You understand? But that's my TED Talk. Subscribe to the channel. It's time to eat. Let's get to it. Let's get to work. You feel me? Peace out.